Hello, Damon Mercy Solutions. Today we're going to look at the durability of the Sony Optical Disc Archive cartridge. The cartridge uh, is stored in a plastic case and can be accessed with a standalone drive or in a robotic library. Okay, so the first test is a drop test where you can see the cartridge has been dropped from approximately 180 centimeters. In the second test, the cartridge is placed onto a strong magnetic field, placed on here for seven days. Um, and you can see that uh, no issues occur with this either. The third test, um, we take eight kilovolts of electricity and physically charge the cartridge to uh, eight kilovolts. And you can see that uh, this again causes no problems. Now, if this was an SSD or a hard drive, there's a good chance that you're going to damage the electronics or the control boards, or even worse, the chip that actually controls the encryption on those drives, losing all of the data. So the fourth test, we can see that the uh, cartridge is placed into an industrial freezer and it's kept at minus 40 for 14 days. Um, again, the cartridge survives this, no problem. During the fifth test, the cartridge is placed um, onto the uh, vibrating table. And we can see that again, the cartridges can withstand random vibration, such as uh, this in transport or moving around. The next test, we actually uh, place the cartridge on the floor and drive a car over it, um, placing approximately 400 kilograms of force onto the unit, um, which causes no damage again to the cartridge as it's protected by the actual storage case. And in the next test here, you can see the cartridge is placed into uh, assimilated flood water, which actually causes the whole cartridge to fill up with uh, this dirty water. And we can see that the cartridge can then be taken apart cleaned, put back together once dry, and then again, the data read back off of it. Um, again, if this was a hard disk or tape or other storage medium, there's a good chance that you're actually gonna lose the data. Thank you for making it to the end of the video. If you'd like to learn more about this technology, please consider subscribing to the channel and also liking, sharing, and commenting below, as this will help others find the video as well.